any movement on guns in the state legislature could be pushed until next year if some state lawmakers have their way. This comes in the wake of the Covenant school shooting that took six lives and forever changed the Green Hills community. Amelia Young joins us live from the state capitol this morning to explain. So, uh, Amelia, how to keep students safe has been a huge back and forth debate. What's the latest? Yeah, exactly right, especially the past uh, week and a half now, Rebecca. But just yesterday, a Senate committee voted to postpone any and all firearms legislation until 2024. Of course, not all lawmakers agree with this decision because they want to make some changes. Democratic Senator Jeff Yarborough says he is going to try to do whatever he can to push forward related legislation right now. It comes as Governor Lee has said he supports some form of a red flag law, which Tennessee does not have in place right now. But as long as it does not violate constitutional rights. He says the focus would be on keeping firearms from dangerous people, but now that legislation may not have the chance to be up for discussion this year because of that vote. Now, some in the state, especially Democratic lawmakers, have been calling for stricter gun control for years, but have recently made their voices even louder following last week's shooting, especially after learning that the shooter had seven firearms all of those were purchased legally. Now, the governor has urged the General Assembly to find something that all sides, Democratic and Republican, can agree on. We'll be sure to keep you updated.